So the Washington Hospital Association is making a point where a few weeks ago, the worst part of getting a shot seemed to be about getting an appointment to get the shot. Now you can get a shot just about anywhere, even walking up here to Lumen Field, which builds itself as the largest vaccination site in the country. Lumen Field so far has given out 85,000 shots, and it's just one mass vaccination site in the state, just one venue to get an injection that ranges to include local grocery store pharmacies, to pop up and mobile clinics, even a Mariners game. The State Department of Health says more than half of us have at least one dose, and nearly 43% of Washington is fully vaccinated. Is it working? This graphic from the State Department of Health suggests that it is, that the number of hospitalizations is finally dropping again, is Washington's fourth wave ending. The first one is really good news, which is that um, two weeks ago when we spoke with you, we were seeing a really sharp jump in hospitalizations across the state. Cassie Sauer heads the Washington State Hospital Association. A year ago, hospitals were packed with sick COVID patients, especially older people, but hospitals say the sickest patients now are young and very, very sick and unvaccinated. But while there is still grim news to report, have we started to turn the corner for the better? Yeah, it's a really hard question to answer. Dr. John Lynch is an infectious disease specialist at UW Medicine. At first, he hesitated on that question, but as he thought about it, that I think we'd be looking at potentially our last big surge. And while his hospital, Harborview, is seeing some of the toughest cases, if the variants don't get past the vaccine, there's hope that we've reached a tipping point for the better. It, short answer is yes, I think we are at an inflection point. Um, and only the next few weeks will really tell us. So far, there has not been a variant that's been able to get past the vaccine. At Lumen Field, Glenn Farley, King 5 News.